It's the oldest family business in Turkey, and the nature of the business is about happiness and spreading the happiness. <laughs> dream childhood, I can say that, because I was surrounded by candy and sweets all the time. I was barely reaching the counter and the jars, but still I was trying to do that, where I was serving the sherbets or lemonade. I feel the pressure all the time because it's a company who survived for 242 years, two <laughs> world wars and so many other wars and economic crises. But I'm super proud of it because we're doing everything to keep the taste safe. We're not sticking to a recipe, for example, cook it for 20 minutes, because ingredients change, climate change. But the secret is confectioner's control. The most popular sweets would be Turkish light with pistachio. That's the most classical one. Turkish light with rose. Uh, it also has a fan club for itself. the chance to observe the innovations in Europe. I think it's early 19th century when starch was introduced into food industry. And also at the same time, I think, refined sugar was introduced. It wouldn't be fair to call him the innovator of Turkish delight, since it's an anonymous recipe. But he is the inventor of the modern Turkish delight we're producing and we're eating right now. He was really young, but it was his mother who helped him how to rule a company, how to manage things, so she was a strong character. My grandmother was the only child, a girl, and then came my aunt and my mother, two girls. Now I'm here, so it's a nice thing to have, I think, because, I mean, Haji Bekir is such a masculine and such a traditional name, but when you look at the company right now, it's us. But also in Ottomner, it was really important because it was close to the palace. All the trade was held here. Uh, it has a coast to Golden Horn, so it was an important place. It's still an important neighborhood. Hüzünlü gününde, tatlı gününde, en sevişli günde yanlarındayız. Bu ayrı bir keyif veriyor bize. Tabii ki Leyla Hanım'la çalışmak ayrı bir keyif verici gerçekten. Samimiyetle söylüyorum. Yenilikler, yeni lezzetler, yeni buluşlar, yeni paketler, yeni yeni görseller. Tabii ki daha bir duru verici, dışa açılım. Farklı bir görsel, farklı bir tat. Daha tabii ki daha çok hoşumuza gidiyor. We are working on new stuff to keep up with the new generations. The great thing that they are also interested in their heritage and culture. Sesame, the one we made this morning, and mustic. Cinnamon and lemon, these are our most popular hard candies. We created a flavor uh, for hard candy with anise and another one with viola flower. I think that will be the more modern product we have here. It has a floral taste, so it's not that super, super sweet. Households are getting smaller or people are consuming less sweets. We even created a small sugar-free line for diabetes. The 
customers, they warn us. You're Hacı Bekir, you're traditional, you can't be this modern. So I think it's really important to blend modern elements with traditional ones to keep on the tradition. And we have a close relationship with Pandili. We're neighbors in Eminönü. You can find our products here, especially candied coriander, a typical Turkish dessert, especially for after meals, our most famous Turkish delights, and hard candies. Imagine working in a place where you can taste every kind of sweets you're producing, so that's amazing. And now I'm doing what I always wanted to do.